8-bit dull retro mechanical keyboard that looks like an NES right after this. Okay, maybe it doesn't resemble an NES, but the color scheme definitely does remind us of that. There's two models. There's one that matches the NES that's released in the North American version and other places around the world and the Famicom edition as well. They're both wireless. They have additional two programmable buttons that can be used, supporting both Bluetooth and 2.4 gigahertz wired or wireless as well. And of course, just like any other mechanical keyboard, the PCBs are hot swappable. Works with Android, Windows, and of course, many other things as well. Mapping can be done on the PC as well as setting up macros. It has a 2000 milliamp lithium ion battery that requires four hours of charge time, 87 keys, giving you a full keyboard experience. So let's take this out, let's have a look at what's inside. It looks definitely nicely packaged, well protected. And of course, we're gonna start off with the keyboard itself. Let's open this up, let's have a look at this magnificent keyboard. That's gonna give us the clickety clackety sounds that we've been waiting to hear ever since it was announced. Look at that, beautiful. Those clacks were really nice. All right, let's put that aside. Let's see what else is in a bunch of stickers and things you can use for the programmable additional buttons. We don't need that, let's put that back. Of course, the manual, probably not gonna use this. USB cable, we've got plenty that goes right back into the box. Do not need it. Where are those buttons we've been looking forward to? Oh, there we go, right under all of this packaging. Let's take this out, let's have a look, also well packaged, ready to go, and there they are, magnificent. And of course, you can plug in four sets of these, so eight buttons in total that plug right into this keyboard at the very top. They're nicely labeled over here at the top, so they're easy to find. There's the uh, USB dongle, USB port. That's USB-C, of course, and here we go. This is where they plug in. You see there's three other ports you can use to plug in more of these guys right into the keyboard. Love those sounds. Definitely something that is going to be cool. But until next time, keep on gaming. That's it for this one. Hope you all enjoy. Take care. See you all in the next one.